Critics guests say they haven't seen their daughter Jocelyn since Dece Joycelyn since December of 2016. They believe she's being held against her will by R&B singer R. Kelly in one of his homes. Over the last few years, the Savage family have fought to see their daughter again, and they refuse to give up until they're reunited with her. Here today are Joycelyn's mother, Jocelyn, and her dad, Timothy, and their attorney, Gerald Griggs. In the audience are their other daughters, Jalen and Jory. Thank you guys for being here. Yes. I'm so sorry for what you're going through. Yes. So I just want to, just last week, R. Kelly's manager, Henry James Mason, was arrested after allegedly threatening your life and your family's lives over the accusations of, uh, against R. Kelly. So I want to ask Timothy, why did you press charges? Well, this is a very serious matter. Um, the, the aggressiveness of Mr. James Mason was very so much real. Um, I called the police immediately. They came out, they took the statement, and they moved forward from there. Wow. Do you, what, when you, when the arrest actually took place, what do you think that message sent to Mr. Mason? It sent the message that we're not going to tolerate people mm -hmm. being bullied from Mr. Kelly. Now, you've made multiple requests to R. Kelly's lawyer to see Joycelyn in public. Have you heard anything back? Just as we, recent ago as last week, we made a request to both lawyers, uh, and we still have not heard back about a definitive time or date we can see her. Uh, so it's becoming very concerning. Again, he's had three previous lawyers, two previous managers, two of which have made threats to my clients. So we wow. are in very much need to see her immediately, face-to-face, -face, yeah. in a neutral location, mm -hmm. either Nashville or Atlanta. When was wow. the last time you saw her in person? It was December 2016? Yes, December of 2016. That's the last time we saw. Wow. We did an intervention tape. Okay. And um, the intervention would show more detail about what was going on, how Jocelyn looked. She didn't look like herself. She looked like she had lost around about, she weighed about 90 pounds. And Jocelyn what? was roughly about, average about 120, somewhere like that. Wow. She looked totally different. And it, it, it really tore my heart up to see my daughter look yeah. that way. If you see... If you're granted to see her, what do you want to say to Joycelyn? I want to let my daughter Joycelyn know that your mother, your father, your family, extended family, we all love you. And we understand that, that you have been manipulated by Mr. R. Kelly, but we just want you back and we will gradually help you get back to what we know you are. And just try to get her, get her home to let we love her, love her, no matter what mistakes she thinks she's done or what he's embedded in her head, she always has a place at home. That's right. What was the last, the last phone call you got from her? What did she say? How did she sound? The last phone call. Well, my wife, it was in December 2017. We was uh, sitting by the Christmas tree. My wife was sitting down and it was like a 30 second call. And she was demanding that my wife say certain things. But when I walked into the room, the phone hung up. It was like a prison call. Mm. Wow. Wow.